I was fine. <laughs> Lali, thank you for your 20 biddies, buddy. Very much appreciated. Uh, can't wait for Battlefield 2042. But as I know, 2042 is just multiplayer. There is no single player campaign. And as I said, I am bad at shooters, so I stay away from uh, PvP shooters, <laughs> as I would be just too bad. And you hear just my dog in the background. Sorry about that. It's just my mom who's just arriving. Uh, he wants. She wants to pick up her new phone, which she ordered yesterday. Because oh, there's another, another interesting, funny story, whatever you want to call it. I wanted to do the layer pass, but thank you so much, Carter, that you didn't do it. Um, yeah, sorry about that. My bad. Um, yeah, so he's just picking up, just picking up a uh, phone, and my brother is here, so he can take care of that. Beautiful. Uh, yeah, so my mom has a new phone. Uh, let me tell you the story quickly. Um, so, oh, where should I start? Let's say like that. My mom is very dependent on her phone because she's using it as a calendar. She has all the all the, um, the necessary numbers in there and um, memos and stuff. So her phone is her life in a way. And she was just saying, oh yeah, I should make a backup at some point again. I haven't done a backup in quite some time. Uh, time. And oops, there was a screen. Um, but she didn't, and she was working in the garden, and had her um, phone in a fanny pack. And actually the day before that, we were working on our garage, and she had her phone in the fanny pack as well. And my brother said, why don't you just get rid of your fanny pack, it's actually in the way of the stuff we want to do. And she said, no, there's my phone in there, and if, if there's anything with your sister or something, anything uh, which is, um, that, that is necessary that she has to be damn it, uh, available, uh, she wants to keep it on her body, and we was like, okay, if you want to do it, it's, it's up to you. So, then, to the next day, she's working in the garden and trying to get rid of some plants she doesn't like and stuff, and just cleaning the front yard and stuff, and, um... If you guys have a home, um, an own, your own home and stuff, and you have, uh... Like, there are, you, you can buy some... How do we call this, actually, in English? Um, I want to say boxes, but boxes is not the right word, to be honest. Uh, for rain, so that you can catch the rain and you can use the rain water as um, water for your plants and stuff. So we have a bunch of those uh, buried in the ground, so the water can get in there from the uh, from the ceiling and stuff. And uh, yeah, so she was working in the garden, and um, for some reason, well, I don't know why, she says she's, she's not even she doesn't even know why she did it. She was putting one foot on the lid of that uh, box. Still saying box, although it's the wrong term, but I think, this, I think you guys know what I mean. And uh, yeah, and the lid gave way, and she fell in. <laughs> Sorry they laughed, but she fell in, and I didn't hurt it. I was, I was up here. I was recording something, so I had no idea what was going on. And later I went downstairs and I saw my mom naked, and I was like, oh, okay, she was taking a uh, maybe a shower or something. I don't know. And then she told me, no, she was falling, actually, she was actually falling in. <laughs> um, but only with one leg, and a little bit of her ass, and so the fanny pack went in, went in two. And the phone was wet, and she was like, oh, it's not that, not that bad, that, that big of a deal, it was just a little bit, a little bit wet, not that much. Wow, shit. I thought I quick point. And that's just a two, damn it. Um... So yeah, she said, oh no, it's fine, I, she wiped it off, and it didn't look like there, there was no water coming from from the inside dripping outside or something that they would see that there's any damage. So it was still in, in, in the case and stuff, and the case was wet, but the phone was actually mostly dry. So she was like, okay, then it wasn't that bad, to be honest. Uh, and then she was like, okay, it's, it's, it, it was also still working, and it was still working the whole day. And then in the night, she wanted to go to bed, and she put it on her nightstand and um, connected it with a cable to charge it. So... Uh, and everything went okay, I, still okay. And then in the next morning, she got up and her phone was... Um, um, she has a notification light in the top corner. And uh, that was blinking red. And normally if it's blinking red, it means phone is empty, recharge. And she wanted to start the phone. It didn't. It was off. She couldn't start it whatsoever. Uh, why are there sounds... Oh, okay, half time, that's why maybe sounds are missing. So, um, yeah. 
so the thing is there was some water inside of the phone coming through actually the little um point where you put your charger in there was some water inside and by charging it overnight she actually fried the battery and it is actually non-replaceable she was in a, in a specialized shop for that for hand for um smartphones and stuff and they said first we can't get your uh, data out of that at all uh, we can't save it and you can't get in you can't get a new um a new battery or something it wouldn't work it just it's like a shortcut in the whole system and yeah so you need a new phone and this is why she's getting a new phone now and uh yeah but this is this is sometimes what what the hell is wrong with the sounds there's no rim sound that's so weird yeah but just by um yep yeah, we are just a very unlucky family um i don't know if you guys still remember that i destroyed my tv unwillingly uh, today I nearly destroyed my webcam unwillingly. Uh, yeah, so um, somehow the last I don't know two months has been pretty um, unlucky. Somehow. <laughs> yeah. Oh, we're actually leading. I didn't even recognize. Nice. Uh, Pokey, FPS games are always rage-filled experience for me, especially in multiplayer. Yeah, 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 yeah. Actually, um, back in the days when uh, Fortnite was released, first, the very first time, um, the very first season, um, a buddy and I, we were playing on PlayStation some Fortnite, and I quickly realized I'm, I'm too old for that stuff. <laughs> Can't do that. I'm not as quick um, and with my hands, not as quick with my mind. Let's say it like that. Yep. Why are the in-game sounds so weird? Why is there no rim sound? What the hell? Oh, this is so weird. Ara from an A? Ah, uh, I'm not quite sure. But it seems like it, right? Because the network is unstable. It might be, might be. Rain barrels. Really, leak. Rain barrels. That makes sense, actually. Yeah, it's a barrel, yeah, because it's round and stuff. Yeah, yeah, sure. Thanks. All right, you are from an A. Yeah, this is this is another thing that I would like to see in the game. I would like to have um, like um, nationality flags. Um, no, it's fine. It's fine. Oh, totally fine, Rami. Like nationality flags to my, to the names, because I have friends from EU server and an A server. So not quite sure what's wrong with the rim. Yeah, this would actually help a lot that you know if this guy is from Europe or not. That might be um, very helpful. Um, to decide who you want to play with and on which server you want to play on. Because now it would be actually better for Ara to play on NA. He would carry us a lot. Although he's still hitting quite nicely. Um, yeah, yeah. But I'm not, I'm not good on A. Oh, and there's another thing. If you guys, I don't know if you guys have realized that uh, last week. I think it was, yeah, it was last week. Um, on one day, Europe server was offline. It didn't work anymore, so yeah, that was weird. And but but only for for a few hours, if I'm not mistaken, because in the evening I got online, and I was like, okay, then I'm gonna do my my daily day, uh, my daily quests, my daily games, and this will be fine. And then I started the first game. I was playing with Lali, by the way. And uh, upola, what the hell? And uh, yeah, the first game was like, I was like, okay, I don't know these enemies, uh, the enemies, <laughs> I don't know the opposing team, the, the players. So I was sure ah, that might be an easy game. And then I saw the guys uh, with um, outfits on and I was like, hmm, maybe those are guys from an A coming to Europe and trolling a little bit or something. And then I was like, hmm, it looks like I'm the troll because it says that my network is unstable. And I was like, huh, what the hell is going on? And I was automatically on an A server, East. Although the EU server was online again. And since then, um, when you start up the game, it says in the, in the top, it says, check your ping and check your server and match with the uh, best suitable server or something like this. Uh, so, yeah. Yeah, this is so weird that there is no rim sound. This is actually off-putting a little bit. Yeah, this was actually a very, very um, interesting and hurting 
experience because I lost by a lot. I couldn't get any rebalance, every shot was off because my timing was not there and stuff. So yeah. Um, what actually did we win? Did we lose? I don't know. JPZ is MVP, so they win? I haven't looked at the score. Oh, we won! Cool! I'll take it. 